FrameMaker 2019 New Features All new PDF Engine to create better PDF faster than ever before. One of the most visible changes in the 2019 release of Adobe FrameMaker is in the production of PDF. While the Save as PDF option is still visible in the File menu, that command now invokes a new PDF engine located in the Publish pod. This faster, more repeatable method of creating PDF moves PDF controls into the same location as HTML5 and other digital output. And it consolidates your PDF settings preferences into the same STS file used to store settings for these other outputs. But it's more than just a change of scenery. Between the new PDF engine and FrameMaker's new 64-bit architecture, PDF production gets a double helping of processing improvements producing PDF files over 60% faster than before. But why stop there? Speed isn't everything, so we've also improved the options available and reduced the post-processing needed when creating PDF via the published pod. There is increased control over printer's marks and sheet size, and security controls can now be set directly from within FrameMaker. Diddy users also get direct output of Diddy maps and a greatly simplified method of managing output options and templates from the published pod, instead of saving interim versions of content and editing initialization files. We've put information on these data specific options into a separate video that we created on that topic. You may have noticed that bookmarks are absent from the PDF published settings. Because bookmarks are dependent on the styles used in a specific document, these settings are still stored separately in a FrameMaker file, along with options for tagging content based on style, giving you even tighter PDF 508 compliance. For a personalized demo or questions, please write to us at techcom at adobe.com.